folks, Queen Row Kill Candy here, and today we're doing a box opening of Super Nintendo Entertainment System Classic. And um, this was actually a gift to me because I completed my diploma. I have a bachelor, but I need the diploma to get courses to move over. Um, you know, and then I can switch my masters. So. Here's all the ones you get inside. It's going to be awesome. And I've heard reviews that it plays quite similar, um, like for um, a uh, emulator system. It's It actually does pretty good. I've heard, though, that other emulator systems, like I don't know if you remember the... Oh, I forget the name of it, but they like put their console just outside during one of the um, big conferences and got sued and all that. <laughs> and then they were no more. Alright, I got it open. Just put this in the background. So. Here's the Don't Play If You Have Seizures and Don't Play For Too Long book. And it looks like there's an actual book in there. Oh, okay, it's, it's the poster and the instructions. It's just like when I was a kid and you'd... Oh, and yeah, here's the instructions on how to do it. And the other side's going to be the poster. I actually still have uh, my... Legend of Zelda poster. I don't have the cart any... No, I still have the cart. I still have the cart. It's just mixed in with my stuff. Alright. So it's really small. I don't have a Super Nintendo at me at... Because I'm house-sitting right now. But... Uh, I'll do a review of it later, and then you can know what my thoughts are on this particular one. And then I'll show you the size difference. But yeah, it's quite light. I heard that when, if you unscrew, it's just a retro pie in there, which is why people have been modding them, because um, it's a very versatile system on the inside. So there's the ports. Here's the cord. It basically looks like it runs on the same power as your phone, which is pretty epic. Yeah. And here are the controllers. And if you look, they're not USB, but kind of USB. You can get better ones. I've seen all over the place better controllers that you can get. I hear these ones aren't that good. I will do a review, though, and tell you what I think. They're um, not horrible feeling. Like, the Sega system definitely came with worse ones if you got the retro Sega system. They're, they're pretty good. They're still pretty light, though, and I heard the... I mean, I'll open up the cords in just a second and we can see how long the cords are. But first, let's get to the bottom and see what else is in here. It's just the rest of the setup cords. So, um, since it's HDMI, I assume I didn't bother looking at the box because I didn't care if it did, but I assume it uh, goes to the resolution of HDMI TVs with the cord, just the power and all that. It's basically the same as your phone, like I said before. Um, and I'm going to open this up this cord so we can see how long it is. Hang on. All right, so we got it open. And I just want to show you how long that is. So we can even move back. And, I mean, for modern setups, that's probably not that good, but for older setups, I guess it's okay, but there's extenders you can buy and all that, and other ones you can buy. Anyways, thanks so much for watching uh, the box opening of the 
S E N S the S N E S classic. Please like and subscribe, and I will be adding more. Bye.